important story, but how will it impact a stock like Delta Corp? Manglam joins in with the details. Manglam. Well, there are two things to look at in Delta Corp. You know, the one of the stories with regards to GST is this uh, due to the show cause notice that uh, has been come from various states. And the second one is the GST rate itself. Now, if you notice the Delta Corp stock price, you know, uh, before all these issues started, the stock price was close to around 250. And, uh, you know, there was a big decline from 250 to 180. That was on the day where the GST Council recommended casino, horse racing and online gaming to be taxed at a uniform rate of 28%. And this tax would be applicable on the face value of the chips purchased in case of casinos. And that caused a bis big business impact to Delta Corp. Has that problem been solved or do we have any visibility there? Turns out not. Where is it that we have some sort of relief as Tim C is putting out? It is basically the GST show cause notice that has come in from, you know, uh, the West Bengal High Court, uh, the Madras High Court as well, which was close to around 23, 24,000 odd crores, for which the company was already not provisioning or providing anything because they believed they had a strong legal case for them to, uh, you know, uh, not pay any of this. And as a result of which, the management here joined us post the third quarter and said that the GST show cause hearing would be ne next month and all claims, like Tim C pointed out, would be clubbed together. And lawyers believe that there is no need to provide for this. So one of the problems of the company seems like it is being solved, but that's not the bigger problem. The bigger problem is that of GST tax rates itself and that making the business itself unfavorable. Let's see whether there is any relief on that front or not. But for that, there is no visibility. Yes, the stock is understandably moving higher, but also be mindful of the fact that open act uh, interest activity in the FNO space suggests that it may go into FNO band. So while there is a relief and the stock has moved back to 150, remember the big reason why it fell from 250 to 180 was the GSC tax rate and not uh, these claims. Okay, all right, uh, Manglam, thanks very much uh, for clarifying that. Yeah, the so market's been very quick to jump. Uh, but we don't know how this plays out because that, um, Mangalam, if you're there, the tax demand that Delta was served was around 23,000 crores, right? Between 23 and 24,000 crores, uh, if you club yeah. all the claims that were made together. Now, we don't know how much of this demand dealt with uh, casino, which is where there's no change. And Tim C is telling us that the, the deliberations are more with respect to online gaming, real money online gaming and not with respect to the revenue that has been earned on casino. So we don't have that breakup uh, in that tax demand uh, that Delta was served with. Thank you so much. And it's important to keep some of these things in mind. Let's uh, get in Prakash Divan.